yeah They thought that you was a shy girl Until I made you my girl Girl, you push me like a big boy Till I cuffed you like you did something You ain't gotta wait for it You ain't gotta wait for me to give you my love You ain't gotta wait for it Things are getting sticky, girl, I think that I'm stuck I'll admit I'm wrong, but I know that you gon' come for me yeah. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So honestly, like this video is going to be super, super short. I'm just going to show you how I lay my baby hairs down. I'm doing two different methods. I'm going to do the comb style with a rat tooth comb. And then I'm going to do the baby hairs with a toothbrush. So there are so many different ways you can do your baby hairs. Um, I just know these two ways. I honestly hate the design looking baby hairs. I feel like that's like kind of ghetto. Um, my hair is pretty much dry. So we're just going to work on the front part. This side I'm going to do the comb method. And then this side I'm going to do the brush method. Okay. So first we're going to work on this side of the hair. So we're going to start with the comb method first. Um, so we're just going to spray a little water just to get it a little bit saturated. When you do your baby hairs, you want them to be wet. You don't want them to be dry. I feel like it's a little harder to do them when they're super, super dry. So go in with your favorite edge control. It doesn't matter what edge control that you use. And we're going to put this down first. I know some people like to do their baby hairs um, like before, like do an outline or rough sketch. but. I like to put my edge control down first and then do my baby hair. So, we're gonna take our rat tooth comb and we're gonna do three different baby hairs. I'm pretty sure you've seen me do this type of baby hair in my, I think it's my ponytail, um, a super, super curly ponytail routine. So basically what you're gonna do, are you watching? We are going to bring this down and we're gonna hold where we want the swoop. And we're gonna bring this up. So you see this line, right? Keep that line because that's going to be your demarcation of where your baby hairs are. Super simple. It's literally a swoop, hold, and push up. And push up, like so. So we're gonna do the second one. This one we're gonna comb down because just to show that line of demarcation. And we are going to push down, hold, and swoop up. Like so. So once again, pull down, hold, and then swoop. So you have that line of demarcation. I don't know why this keeps getting stuck on my head. We're gonna switch rat tooth combs because honestly, this is the comb that I typically use. And I don't want my curls to get frizzy. I still need them to be cute. Now we're going to do the last one. So this one, same thing, swoop. Pull down, pull down the hair, hold, and swoop. Then you can play with this and then you can just bring this piece of hair out so it's like a cute little something something and then you can go back in with some edge control to lay them down so that's how i do the comb method now we're going to work on the brush method so i'm going to do it right up in here make sure you don't get it on your makeup so for this side, we're going to do the same thing. Well, actually no. With a brush, it's honestly a little, little bit different. You wanna brush your hair out first. So brush as much hair out as possible. And then we're gonna add our edge control. I typically like to add it to the edges, cause you'll see why. 
So I just added some to the baby hairs because my hair is dry. Typically when I do my baby hairs, it's wet. So I don't really have this issue. So basically what you're gonna do is you're going to swoop, hold, and swoop up. So you have a nice little swoop going on. And you can play with this, honestly. So that is to your likings. So as you can see, we have a nice swoop. We're gonna do the same for the other side. Swoop and hold. Brush down, swoop and hold. So like I said, push the hair down. And hold and push up. So you have these nice swoops. So you have the comb method and then you have the brush method. So it just depends on what you like to do. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. If you are new to my channel, join the bomb squad because we are the realest squad on the internet. Also leave a comment in the comment box below if you have suggestions for future videos like this one. And girl or guy, I look forward to seeing y'all in my next tutorial. Bye guys.